a four year girl a four year old girl went with her mom to pick up her sister to a, from a music class she saw her sister playing harmonium few girls singing and rest of them playing tabla she got so inspired seeing that music class that she started dreaming that she is playing harmonium by herself she is singing a very beautiful song and she is also playing tabla and then she started insisting her parents i want to go that she wants to go to you know a uh, music class every day and she wants to learn everything then came the very first lesson from her parents that is they said you have to learn one at a time thing she didn't understand initially what one at a time means but then she was given an opportunity that you have to know you have to choose between one of the three classes and she chose tabla reason being she did not see a single girl playing tabla in that class that day and she wanted to be unique in her own way she started learning tabla she started practicing tabla she wanted to be a female version of zakir hussain she was so inspired and she had this concept of one at a time so her complete focus was only on tabla then at the age of 7 her parents taught her you have to learn multitasking along with tabla If you are interested in something else, you can learn that too. That gave her an opportunity to get enrolled to singing class, and she also insisted her sister to teach her to play harmonium. So eventually, she started learning all the three, continuing, you know, her passion and her dreams and everything. Then what happened next? You all might be wondering if she is a music, if she, if she is a musician today, or if she is into some music industry. No, she is not. not sure though <laughs> so it was like she was her passion was something else she wanted to become something else but before i tell you what she was passionate about or what she ended up with let me tell her tell you about more of her interest you know time changing interest i can say she was 10 when she got her first bicycle and she was so excited riding her bicycle that she started dreaming that she wants to become a cyclist and then becoming a cyclist was a big no because she was very much prone to accidents she was an awesome inborn dancer beat any move she used to just go and stand in front of mirror and she used to start dancing beat on any random music or sometimes even without music she wanted to continue her passion so she joined freestyle learning you know freestyle dancing at shamak dawis she learned a lot of different dance forms and she kept practicing the different dance forms but what happened later one day when she was teen her school principal asked her what do you want to become in your life and she was completely blank then suddenly she said i want to become a pilot now she said that because she was so inspired watching a hindi series chuna hai aasman where she saw a woman pilot and she started dreaming that she wants to become a pilot she started working towards it but due to a lot of personal reasons after her board exam she decided becoming a pilot is not everyone's cup of tea she enrolled she started she started going to college she enrolled into an education stream which which, which she was not aware about that where it will be she was studying just for the sake of studying she was <clears throat> she just wanted to be a graduate and clear her professional exam in the meantime her focus was slightly deviated along with her studies she opened her own dance and music class she started teaching kids teenagers adults with you know different forms of dance music and she started preparing them for school inter school competitions national competitions and all due to this she got lot of name and fame from her city she got lot of emerging opportunities from film industry but her destination was somewhere else then came the turning point of her life when her parents told her you are the best judge of yourself think and decide what you want from your life and once you know what you want just go for it be it your hobbies change into your profession or academics being changed to your profession she was then like okay she started thinking a lot and then she understood 
And then she realized where her interest is actually. She realized that her major core interest was her studies. She moved out of her city for pursuing her masters. She did her masters very well. She got into a big multinational company and she's still sticking, she's still with her first multinational company. She's loving what she's doing right now. Then what happened to all her hobbies, what, her passions, her dreams? They are still alive. Still, she's still learning and practicing her music and dance. She still goes out for the cycling during weekends. She still does a lot of other things what she used to love doing. And her life book has many more such new interests and you know adventurous things being written about. Dear friends, the story which I shared with you is none other than my story. I'm Rashmi Rao, came to Bangalore 11 years back with a head full of dreams from Nasik City. And my present dream or interest is on Toastmasters, definitely. <laughs> so I'm dreaming big about becoming a distinguished Toastmaster. Thank you.